she is love and beauty She makes a way, look at the eyes that she be That's that black girl magic That black girl magic That, that, that black girl magic do apologize that this video took so long it probably took like what two three months y'all i'm sorry life happened i started working a full-time job again i have three kids i have a graphic design business i have a beauty business plus on top of my mental health that i deal with um it's just been a lot that's been going on and i don't want people to feel like oh she said she was going to do it and then never do that i am not like other people i know i've seen in the comments um, you know, people saying certain stuff. Um, I really do appreciate if you guys would just understand that I am a human being. Like, life happens. I'm not the type of person that gatekeep and that keep all the information to myself. If I say I'm going to do something, I am going to do it. Um, it wasn't my plan to have it done way sooner, but unfortunately, things start happening in my life and it just happened, okay? So I'm here. So let's just appreciate that I'm here. I'm helping you guys out. This video is going to be very quick. Um, this is just something that I put together for you guys. I do actually have a video um, of me creating this site. Um, this is just a freestyle, freestyle site. This is nobody's site. Um, I bought the stock photos and I just designed it um, because I want to show you guys how to go in to upload, um, which is something that I told you guys I would do. So here we are. Um, so let me go right here. So um, basically what you want to do is you go to your Shopify. So a lot of people have pre-made, uh, banners or pre-made websites on their page that they, you know, create and then they resell, which is something that I do. So when you purchase from me, I'm speaking for myself. When you purchase from me, it's an instant download. Um, you will receive the link and then you will be able to basically save the stuff. It will take you to Canva. Um, when I do the pre-made stuff, I do it on Photoshop. I prefer Photoshop, but when I sell it to you guys, it's on Canva just because Canva is more easier um, to navigate for beginners. Um, so let's go ahead and get into the video. So once you go ahead and you just purchase it from me, um, you can choose whatever theme you want to. I prefer the, the free ones. If you want to purchase a, a theme that costs, you go for it. I personally have never done that. So that's not something I'm going to tell you guys to do. That is going to be a preference. Okay. So the first things first, um, I'm just going to go right here is the header, which you will basically just upload your logo or however you want to do that. We're not going to get into that. Let's go ahead and do the section and you have all these options that you choose from. So you choose whatever it is that you want to do. I'm just going to just go ahead and just start picking things and you just click select image. Um, this is going to be a slideshow. So I'm just going to go ahead and just add this in. And then right here with the heading where it says the image and it says tell your brand story. You want to make sure that you delete that because you don't want that to show in your pictures. I mean, if you do, then hey, or if you wanted to say something else, like I said, it's a preference thing, you guys. Um, so we got the slideshow. You can add more pictures if you want to. Um, I'm going to go in just with the image text overlay. And I'm just going to, again, remove the heading and remove the text because I don't want any of that. I kind of already know what I'm doing. Um, I would say the most difficult thing to do is designing. So, um, uploading this stuff to Shopify is not hard at all. It's the designing part. Um, you have to make sure that you're giving the customer exactly what it is that they want. Um, if you're a designer, designing yourself, Hey, you know what you want, you know what you like, so you can design it and then come on here and you just kind of play around with the features. They have feature collections where the collections you can kind of have on there. They have the gallery. You do however you want to do it, okay? Um, I'm going to go in right here with the gallery, and I'm just going to just pick the pictures um, to put on. Uh-oh. So, yeah, I'm just picking the pictures, um, and then, like, it, it tells you. So, it's, like, really, really easy. It tells you. Um, what you are needing to do so that's the anything that's the easiest thing for Shopify versus Wix um, you're kind of building everything from scratch so this is just what I do um, for right now I'm not going to get more into the other stuff that I do because you know 
this is just my business this is how i do i do certain things certain things i will share certain things i just won't because that's just you know you know that's how i make my money but like i said i don't gatekeep i'm not that type of person but you guys have to still make sure you do your research um i had to do my research nobody really helped me out um which was very frustrating but anyway, so the footer right here, as you can see, I changed the color, which you can get the hex code. You can Google it, whatever it is your your exact color is. You can just put it right here and just paste it right there and it should pop up at the bottom for you. This is the footer. Um, I don't really focus too much on a footer, but as you can see, I have my slideshow. I have the banners. Um, I have the gallery that I want and then the shop snap and slay. So you want to make sure that you always save um, anything can happen. Usually I save after each section I add just because stuff happened. Um, you want to go right here to preview. And this is a preview of showing you basically how it will look on a desktop. So that's how it will look on a desktop. You can go right here to change it to a mobile. And this is exactly how it will look on a mobile. Um, so you can change it, you know, to see just how it will pop up on you know just different stuff so it's really you know just a vision of you know to see how things is um so once you're done this is just what i do i preview it and then i have this for chrome to where i just go it's a go full page that only chrome can use google chrome and it captures the whole full website for me that way i can just get a vision of okay this is exactly how it look um you know, I want to change this or what, however you want to do it. This is just how I do it. Then I download the PDF file and then I upload it to Canva and I create my mock-up. That is like pretty much it, you guys. <laughs> like it's really, really easy. Um, That is pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And again, I do apologize that it took me so long to get to you guys. I'll see you in another video.